Now, let us invite Aranadi Ramya Amma to share the thought for today. Be blessed by the Divine. Thank you, Aya. Be blessed by the Divine. A noble thought from Blossoms of Life. Eradication of sin imprints. Evil deeds are those that harm the self or the others. All thoughts, words and deeds produce imprints in the life energy. Sin, sin imprints classified into Agamya Karma, Prarapta Karma and Sanchita Karma on the basis of their quality and effects are registered in the Jnana Karmendriyas, brain cells and the reproductive cells. They are passed on through heredity and are the reason behind the miseries that clog human lives. The mind can be purified and the sin imprints eradicated through the practice of meditation, expiation, superimposition and dissolution. It is to be noted that sin imprints can be eradicated only when the mind is strengthened and the resolve not to repeat the earlier action made. Broad mindness, clarity of thoughts, magnanimity and awareness are essential qualities. Mental acuity and the ability to understand and cooperate with the others should be developed for a peaceful, happy and contented life. I'd like to share my view. Evil deeds are actions that affect us and others. We are getting imprints for each thoughts, words and deeds. Every action has result Imprints are classified as Akamyam, Praraptam and Sanjitam. These are stored in our body cell, brain and sexual fluid. These imprints transfer genetically to our generations. How can we avoid sin imprints? If we do meditation and introspection daily, it gives awareness and purity in our mind. We could avoid imprints through continuous practice and effort. How can we attain peaceful life? Improving concentration, grasping power, acceptance, generosity, effort on constructive actions along with the Broader mindset and awareness helps us to lead our life with happiness, fulfillment and peace. Thank you, Aya. Be blessed by the divine.